In today's video, I'm going to show you how I transformed this video background into looking like this highly professional video background and even this one. To do that, I gathered screenshots of video backgrounds I love from the popular YouTubers I watch and I came over to ChatGPT and told ChatGPT, I'm going to give you an image now and I want you to describe the background only of that image with a detailed prompt that I can use to generate the replica of that. I just want you to describe the background vividly, excluding the person in the image and all that and all that. I will leave this prompt in the document linked in the description. Go ahead and find out. And ChatGPT came back and said I should share the image, which I then clicked on this paper clip icon here and click on upload from PC, which I uploaded and I hit enter. It came back with an image prompt which I then copied and went over to my Canva account. And I clicked on here, Dream Lab. When you come onto Dream Lab, you can create beautiful images with Dream Lab and you get 20 points if you're on a free plan and more points if you're on a pro plan every month. So what I want you to do when you come over to Dream Lab is to first set the aspect ratio you want to download your image in or you want Dream Lab to generate the image in it, which is 16.9 for me, which is for the YouTube video I want to use it in. And for the presets, there are various presets. It has said that cinematic concepts, creative, smart, bouquet, all these presets are here. I'm going to leave it on smart so that they can use its intuition to generate this image for me. And then I'll paste my image prompt and click on enter. These are the images it came up with. I'll open that up so we can see. It. This is one of the images. If you hover around the images and you like anyone, you can either click on these three dots to create a new design or edit the image folder, or you can download the image or just hit edit here. I will download the four of them. So I did the same for the three other images and this is what I came up with for one and this is the other one. And this is the other one and this is another one now i'm going to click on one to take me into the edit so it has opened it up as a new design but i'm going to change the file size because it's not in the right file size i want to design with so i'm going to click on this resize and i'm going to choose a youtube video i have the option to copy the design and resize but i'm just going to resize the design so i don't have to duplicate on it and i'll hit on resize if you're using a Canva free account, you can just download your image and go to create a new design and open a new video doc type. Now that we have the right video file size, I'm going to import all my images in here. Now that I have all my images in my uploads tab, I'm going to select the images I want to use and spread it out. Let me close this. To come over to position, we'll see that we have our four images layered. And if we go back to our uploads, now you must have uploaded the video you want to use. I'll just go to video tab and click on this video. I'm going to spread it out as well. Now let's click on edit here and click on BG Remover. Let's remove the background of my video and I'll go to adjust. You can choose to adjust the settings of your videos from here. Let's go back. I'm going to apply a filter to my video. I'm going to apply the festive filter. You can choose to increase the intensity of your filter through this place. And you can choose to enhance the voice in your video through here. All these are pro feature. Is the link in my description to get that in this free trial and try these features out on Canva. Now let's close this out and let's go back to position. We want to try out each of this background which one we like best for our video so i'm going to hit on play to test each of the four of them and this one look realistic i kind of like it so i'm going to move this background up so we can try that out this one too looks also realistic but i'm not sure about how real it looks because of the floor rock here so I'm going to move this video background up. You see? Don't need to play this one to see that no, it doesn't work for me really. Look at that. The floor. I can't be sitting under the ground. Now let me move this one up. 
let's play that this one looks more really appeared as if i was sitting on the couch so i'm going to go ahead and delete the other backgrounds and i'm going to click on this background here and i'm going to come over to these three dots and set the image as my background let's preview that this is the final result subscribe to the channel for more videos like this give this video a like if you got value from it and do have a good one